Hey crafty friends, this is Jenny from crafttestimonies.com and today I'm here to share with you some stencils. These were ones I picked up at CHA in January and um, it looks like the stencil craze is not dying down anytime soon. So case in point, here are some new ones from Handmade Charlotte. They're being published out by, by Plaid and Rachel Fawcett designed these. Um, these are actually cardboard stencils, kind of like the old-fashioned ones you buy your kids, and you're going to have to punch them out. And um, I guess these are probably more for the kind that you actually trace and draw. Um, it is like craft paper, and I can't imagine that these would hold up with your inky sprays um, too very well. But the designs are cute. They're paper stencils, 47 designs in the package. Uh, also, Claudine Helmuth is um, doing some dye happiness. They come in a cute little pack like this, and she's got some florals. Um, it looks like the bird craze. Hey, let me put a neat th another piece of paper down so you can see them a little bit better. Nope, oh, that's not the right one. Like this, maybe. Yes. See, this is what I do. Uh, so, um, looks like the bird craze is still going strong. Here's some florals, some cute little houses and um, textures, and then birds on a wire. So these are all cute. She's got some more coming out too, but. Um, these are just the ones I picked up at CHA. Um, Diane Rivoli is continuing on. I didn't get any of her fresh ones. There's another video that we have on our blog that shows her kind of male and female figures, but these are the large format ones, and I'm glad to see ones that aren't 12 by 12s, but are just fun textures. She likes to work in the journals, and these are just a couple that I picked up uh, from the Ranger booth. I actually really kind of dig this perspective action, so, and some fun borders too. And then of course, uh, I don't know, can I call her the queen of all stencils? Can I call Julie Faith and Balzer the, the queen of stencils? Um, she puts these out through the Crafters Workshop and they're stunning. So she's got some cool hexes, this one that looks like a London underground tube map, um, some segmented ones. These actually remind me a lot of her hand carved stamps. Some fun textures. Here's another kind of a tribal motif. Notice the tribal action here. And then uh, I kind of love this too. And there was one more that I had in the stack that I really like, but I can't find it now, but maybe it'll show up uh, in the blog post instead. But anyways, the bottom line is, oh, and I was going to show you in my little sketchbook, I was playing around a bit and using some of these didn't turn out really well. But here you can see I did a um, resist technique with Julie stencil here and actually did some layering through here as well. So it looks to me like the stencil craze is not going anywhere soon. And my question for you is, do you like it? Do you love it? Are you ready for it to fade? Um, feel free to leave me a comment and let me know. Also, give this video a thumbs up if you found it helpful, and we'll see you over at crafttestdummies.com. Thanks and have a crafty day.